guys it's me Missy Beauty I'm back back again not in my regular place that I film which is my beauty room slash closet slash office I am in my bedroom and I'm in my bedroom because right after this video I am gonna be filming the stitch fix that I got so I got the stitch fix maybe two weeks ago need to get that done I've got three boxes here. I've got Ipsy for this month, which is November. I've got the Allure November, and I've got the, I hope that's the Allure November. Yeah, I think it is. Do they have dates on this thing? Like on the box, the shipping label? I don't see one. But, and then I have BoxyCharm. So I've got Ipsy, Allure, and BoxyCharm today. I'm not sure if I'm going to do all three. Maybe. Why not? I think I might do it. So you're going to have to grab a snack, maybe grab a glass of wine or water or whatever it is. Me, maybe orange juice or tea. Um, but yeah, it depends on what type of, time of day it is. Not type of day, but time of day it is. So yeah, grab a snack. Let's get it started. All right, guys, I am going to start with BoxyCharm. For those of you that don't know, I believe BoxyCharm is about $28. I'm going to put the prices here like I always do. Uh, it does come in a black and white box. Um, and in the inside, it is red and white. Um, they tried to stuff this in my uh, mailbox. And so I had to rip it to get it out. But yeah, so let's go ahead and open it this way. Um, you do receive a card. Oh, what is this? Interesting. Ooh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I see. I'm trying to get to the card. So you do get a card with the theme of the month. Uh, I am excited about what I see already. Um, BoxyCharm, it's giving, giftable glam. So they're, they're obviously talking about the holiday season and giving. Thanksgiving is coming up and gifting, which Christmas is coming up soon after that. Um, that is a nice little statement. It's giving giftable glam so uh your products are listed on the back i'm sorry about the uh, lighting in here maybe this will help so you've got your uh it's very rainy here you've got your items on here and what they retail at so let's go ahead and get started with the first one that i'm seeing ceramic tourmaline bristles glide through hair Infrared technology locks in moisture for frizz-free hair. What do you think that is? <laughs> this is a thermal heat brush. Let's see what they're saying. It's by Soleil Hair Tools. Mini heat brush. All right, let's see. This tool is perfect for, am I recording? Yes. This tool is perfect for on-the-go styling and touch-ups. It's as powerful and easy to use as a full-size tool, but compact enough to carry with you everywhere you go. Uh, the rapid heat time and heat resistant bristles allow this cute handy brush to glide through your hair. Depends on what kind of hair it would be attempting to glide through. <laughs> um, let's see. Da -da -da -la -la. Let's see. Handy brush to glide through your hair quickly and easily. Uh, safe for all hair types. Welcome um, your new favorite hair tool. This is saying it's $150. $150. Let's go ahead and take it out of the packet. So let's go ahead and do that. It comes in a bag like this. So this would be a nice little gift for someone, I can see that. Okay. So this is, it comes in plastic. Nice, I don't know, it's 
They're pretty hard, so I can see it working on my hair or my daughter's hair. And then you have the plug-in right here. So here it is. This is the back of it. And it is hard. And you've got your switch here on off. Doesn't look like there's, looks like maybe there's three settings for heat. Let's see if I can get it to focus here. You see that? Yeah. So I want to make sure that the sound is on. Yeah. So this is interesting. I do have one already and I don't use it um, anymore because I go to the hair salon for my hair. This particular one, I do believe I am going to keep. Um, although it is great for gifting, I am paying for this box per month. And a lot of these items, if I like them, I'm going to keep them. This is no exception. I, I know it's around the holiday, but <laughs> I do want to keep this little guy. Um, because I can see me getting some use out of it. And it does have the instructions inside. So I believe I'm going to keep it. I, I'm going to keep it. Um, I can think of a number of people that uh, can use this probably more often than I do. Uh, but I just don't want to give this away. So yeah. And again, I'm going to put the sleeve back on it. And again, they're saying that this is $150. So I don't want to give this away. I will be using it. The next thing I'm going to pull out is in a green container. Greenish, orangish, yellowish. It's by Reveal. It's an ultra hydrating cucumber melon gel mask. Now this sounds interesting, sorry. I don't know what to do about this lighting. Um, and what are they saying about this? Um, okay, it's by the company TYNT Skin, TYNT. Reveal Spa Water Gel Mask, Reveal Beauty Hydrated and Glowing Skin with this refreshing and revitalizing spa water gel mask fortified with hyaluronic acid, cucumber, and melon extracts. It refines the skin and, let's see, it refines the skin with hydration for finer looking pores and an overall healthy radiant glow. So, hmm, I'm going to make sure my makeup is off and I'm probably going to put this on my skin. Let's see. It needs to go on my hands the way my hands look. So let's see if this smells like cucumber. I'm going to take off the safety seal since I'm going to use it. Mm, this is what it looks like. Hmm, let me go make sure I have nothing on my face. I think I washed it last night, but I want to make sure. Be right back. All right, guys, I bought this fan from the dollar store. Really pretty fan. Dollar Tree. Um, and it's good for when I put on my makeup and I have to dry it real fast, uh, whether it be because I'm in a hurry or that I'm in the camera filming a video. Uh, so this is a gel mask. I am going to put it on and I will wa wash it off. I'm guessing you have to wash it off. Apply a thick layer. Leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and gently massage. Okay. In excess or remove by patting excess using slightly damp face cloth. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and use this. Keep it on for 10 minutes. This is what it looks like. It is a gel. Alright guys, 
we will continue on while this mask sits on my face. I did tell the timer, Alexa, to go off in 12 minutes and I will take this off. 12 minutes, I will take this off and we'll see how it makes my skin feel. Uh, if I didn't tell you, this retails at uh, $28. The mask is $28. $28. Okay, the next thing I want to take out is Mango Luna Magic Hydrating Lip Balm. Mango Luna Magic. It looks like maybe there's two in here. Yep, you get two. Lip products guaranteed uh, if it has nothing to do with a lip color, uh, but a moisturizer or a... Um, you know, like a lip gloss, I will use it. That's the mango color. Yes, it's the mango color. Okay, and I won't be trying that right now because I have this mask on. And this right here is the cherry color. All right, and I will be putting that on my lips after I am done with this mask or whatever else is on here. And what are they saying about this uh, man or this uh, lip? Let's see. It's a lush and plush hydrating lip balm, hydrating sheer lightweight lip balm that leaves lips soft and lush, infused with vitamin E to nourish lips. Great for this weather. Great for the weather we're having today. Where I am at in the southeast, it is rainy and it is cold. So. Um, let's see, nourish lips and formulated with a hobo oil to heat, to heal, to heal dry lips and help lock in moisture. $16 by Luna Magic Beauty. Never heard of this. Never heard of this. The next thing I'm going to pull out is, let's see what I got in here. It is a velvet lip liner. These are always hit and miss. Uh, not the Ciate London brand per se, but the lip liners that come in these boxes are always hit and miss. This is by Ciate Lo London. It is a velvet lip liner. Achieve velvety soft lips with this liner. This soft matte intensely, pigment it intensely pigmented formula glides effortlessly. And they all say that onto your lips to, to perfectly define or reshape your lips. All right, $18. Let's take this out and see. This mask has a cooling feeling to it. Um, Sorry, I'm still not sure about that. That was Siri on my Apple Watch. Not sure what she's talking about. If it's this color, I don't know if it'll work for me, but let's take the cap off. Um, this is $18. They're saying it's $18. Oh, I don't know what to do about this. What do you guys think? I don't know if it's going to be my color. Got I got to try it. I gotta try, I gotta put it on my hand. Ah, oh, this color might work. This color might work. And it is somewhat moisturizing. Um, it is not dry, super dry. Not as dry as my hand is. So yeah. $18, we'll have to see, $18 for the lip liner from Ciate London. Let's see if I have, I do have a palette of some kind in here. Excuse my hair and everything, because I knew I was going to be putting on something today. Let's see what else is in here, if anything. Doesn't look like anything else is in this. I did take out the palette. Do you guys see anything else? I don't see anything else. So let's go on and look at this palette that I have down here. 
it says in my element eyeshadow palette by the company I guess it's called item all right it's saying item beauty by Addison Ray in my element eyeshadow palette have them seeing stars with this blendable buildable tin shade shadow palette a cosmic collection of warm shadows cool neutrals and star dusted shimmers for a look that's out of this world this retails at $24 let's see if this is another eyeshadow palette I want to keep but will not use probably let's see it's just so hard to get in these little boxes and you don't want to tear the sides so yeah look it's sh so shimmery it's not really so let's go ahead and see ah i don't know i don't think i'm gonna use this guys i have too many colors like this so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna swatch it this the way it's been packed in here looks like they had to repack it so this might end up being having fallout or something there, there's no need to try it because th this type of shimmer right here I don't like I can tell by looking at it right here and this one over here yeah it's I've got these colors in another uh, palette and if I give it away I don't know if I'll do it and give it in a giveaway because it looks like the way they packed it in it looks like almost that it's someone used it but they haven't it's just I don't know if I'm comfortable with giving it to someone else they'll think it's been dug in or whatever so yeah so guys that is what I have in there sorry that I don't want to swatch this because I will be giving it away to somebody um I don't know if I'm going to put it in a giveaway uh, but yeah, this is unused. It just looks like they tried to pack that shadow in and it looks kind of odd. So it's almost been 12 minutes. No, I don't know. Um, but you know what? Let's keep going. Uh, let's move on to Ipsy. Um, and I will put Ipsy comes in a bag like this and I will put the um ooh, this this part is sticky i'll put the price right here somewhere somewhere um ipsy rivals the boxy charm i get the base box boxy charm this is considered ipsy glam bag plus the original ipsy uh, is small and it it usually contains smaller trial size like products with a few maybe one or two full-size products. Uh, this is the bag that came with it. It is a cheetah print bag, it's cute. Okay, and inside of it, oh, look at there. They have given me a TYNT Skin Afterglow Prime and Set Refreshing Face Mist. And I just got a product like this. Is on my face. I do have the mask on my face by the exact same company. So what better way to uh, go about putting on my makeup than to use like products. I mean products from the same uh, company so I'll be using this when I'm done doing whatever it is I'm gonna do to my face and this is called the afterglow prime and set refreshing face mist it's got tamanu oil and coconut water in it and this is by the same company so I did take that out because it caught my eye 
As far as the um, rest of the items in here, I'm going to have to pull up my a phone to tell you the description and what they retail at. This does say Shop Black Friday with Ipsy. They do put a little card in there uh, this time with advertisements. So yeah, that came in there. Let's see. Oh wow, I see a Yensa product, a primer. Okay, this is gonna be difficult. If I want to say which um, box is the best this go around, it's going to be a little difficult. Let me pull up um, the products on my phone for Ipsy. Um, so you have um, Allure Beauty Box and you have the BoxyCharm that still use cards. But wait, that is my alarm. Is it gonna go off again? So I'm gonna wash my face off and I'll be right back. And when I come back, I'll have it pulled up on my phone. All right guys, I have taken the uh, skincare product off of my face. And again, that was the Tint TYNT Skin Reveal Ultra Hydrating Cucumber Melon Mask. I did have it on my face for 12 minutes. Um, so what I am going to do is go ahead and finish the unboxing uh, for Ipsy. And there are some products in here. I did take a peek that are beauty products that I might want to go ahead and put on my skin. Um, there are also a few um, skincare products I can follow up with um, after that mask. So let's go ahead and take out the first product. It's by Yensa. It's the Color Plus Face Tone Up Prim Primer Essential Glow 8 Super, uh, what's 8 Super Blacks X Essence? I don't know what that means. Um, Graceful Beauty, blah, blah, blah. I like the Yensa brand I oh. found this on the web oh my gosh so let's go ahead and see what Yensa this product is all about let me grab my phone hi guys I'm back um, had to take care of some stuff Luna magic hydrating lip balm in cherry it is scented I did put it on my lips uh, for the rest of the uh, video because they were dry since I had to <clears throat> put that mask on my face it was a little bit dry um, didn't put it on my lips but um, I think the previous uh, cleanser might have dried them out so I've got the uh, ipsy site up I'm gonna go ahead and pull out I actually think I see something that I already have in here but I'm going to pull out, um, let's see, this here. I'm going to pull out a skincare product. There's actually two skincare products in here. Um, there's one that's a facial, and then there's one that is an eye renewal balm. So I'm going to pull that out. Um, and this came with, yeah, let me make sure, yeah. So I'm going to put everything aside. I don't want to mix up the two boxes. So the next thing I'm going to pull out is a triple algae, I think it's algae eye renewal balm. And it's by, Al, I forgot the name of how to pronounce this, Algen, Algenus. Is it Algenist or Algenist? I don't know. All right, and this is formulated with Algoronic Acid. I've heard of Hyaluronic Acid, but not Algoronic Acid. Let's go ahead and see what they say. All right. Uh, let's see, it's $65 
for the full size is 15 ml is the full size so this is the full size 68 dollars in one word everything forget eye creams that target either fine lines and wrinkles puffiness or dark circles this baby helps tackle every under eye issue it's all thanks to the firming peptides hydrating and plumping algoronic acid um, and a trio of depuffing and brightening algae uh, and it also has vitamin E it's saying so let's go ahead and I'm gonna try this I'm gonna put this on since I've got other skincare going on let me see here this is the size of the container and let's open it up here's your eye cream eye creams usually and i need to get a mirror i'm gonna get a mirror yeah eye creams usually um come in the smaller containers because it's just enough you're supposed to put on on your eyes here the under area that you, they don't need to give you a, a big container of it. It should last and go a long way. I use this finger um, and rub this way. Uh, I will rub this way, but in the end I rub inward. I switch in between these two fingers right here. All right, I've got that under my eye. I almost feel like I want to put something else on my face. I don't have a lotion of any kind uh, to put on my face. I did do the mask. Uh, the Reveal Gel Mask from the other box. And I do, from this box, have a face mist. Um, refreshing. Prime and Set. I'm going to use this now. I'll use this now. And let's go ahead and read about that. So, again, side by side, I'll let you see the boxes. This was the Reveal Ultra Hydrating Mask, gel mask, from the Tint Company, T-Y-N-T. That's this one, uh, and that came in the BoxyCharm, and then the T-Y-N-T Skin Afterglow Prime and Set Mist comes in a box like this. So, same company, different uh, subscription boxes here. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face. I will not use a lotion or anything, but I'm gonna spray my face with this um, face, face oil mist. That's what I'll do. I wonder if I can pull this. No, I'll just go like this. So for a mist, it's not as misty. Oh, it has a great uh, like light scent to it. I really do like the light scent. I'm just going to kind of rub it into my skin um, because it's not. It kind of lays it on your face in droplets, not so much misty, but droplets. And I do like this. This is what it looks like when you shake it up. I'm just going to shake it up a little bit more. I didn't, uh-oh. Is it leaking? Let's see. And this is what it looks like. The liquid. <coughs> I think I put too much. <coughs> But yeah, I don't know if you can see up close. 
I, I, I should have shaken it up before I did that. Got a lot of it on my shirt. All right. It smells refreshing. It's just a little light scent to it. Uh, let's see what this is supposed to do. Oh, you know what? I forgot that quick about my fan. Let's see. Where are we at with this one? Let's find it. Hmm. I need to fan my shirt. Let's see, now, um, this one is by TYNT Beauty. I picked it, apparently I picked this one because it tells you, it says you picked this one, okay? And uh, let's see what it says. So you can use it after you put your makeup on or before you put your makeup on. It's $22. They say it's valued at $22. Um, 50 ml is the full size. Uh, and that is what it was. It was 50 ml. It says, this face mist does so much more than refresh your skin. The blend of, there's that word again, tamanu oil and coconut water can hydrate bare skin, prime your face before makeup, or set a finished makeup look. However you use it, you'll be sure with soft, supple, you'll be sure, you'll be sure with soft, supple, glowing skin. All right, so it is $22, okay? So yeah, I'm kind of liking the way it feels on my skin. Uh, you can tell it's thicker than, um, and it has an oil in it. You can see that, look. The oil is on top and the, the liquid is on bottom. So you do have to shake it. You have to shake it well. I like the way my skin looks so far. And it is. Another Elemis uh, product, or not another Elemis product, but another, um, what do you call it, the skincare product. It's by Elemis. It's Superfood Midnight Facial Nourishing Sleeping Cream for all skin types. All right, this sounds right up my alley. Definitely going to be keeping that. So far, I'm liking the Luna Magic Lip Balm that I have on. And that was, again, that was from the um, Ipsy, or BoxyCharm. So you get quite a bit of it. It looks like it is 50 ml or 1.6 US fluid ounces. And I'm not going to be putting it on, but I'll show you the consistency here. Ooh, this smells good too. It has a nice clean scent, not a perfumey scent. Mm. Here we go. Let's see, let's see. Elemis Midnight Facial Superfood. It's $50. This is $50. Um, say bye-bye to... Uh, dry and dull skin with Elemis Superfood Midnight Facial. Uh, this night cream is filled with superfoods like quinoa extract, quinoa, quinoa, quinoa extract, and rich in antioxidants and vitamins that will help lock in moisture as you sleep so that you can wake up to a gorgeously glowing skin. This is $50 and it's 50 ml. This is a nice size for this. I like Elemis products. So this will get some use starting tonight. Again, it's $50. So instead of using this after, instead of using the afterglow after, since I used it as my primer before makeup, I'm probably going to go ahead and use um, this. Well, this is not. I can't use this. This is a primer. 
um, this is not an after thing. So I will be using that um, same one you just saw. But this one is the one I'm going to read about now. All right, Tone Up Primer Essential Glow. $35 for one ounce, which is what this is. Uh, it says it blurs fine lines and pores, smooths uneven texture, uh, like an <laughs> like your favorite Instagram fi uh, filter, and locks in your makeup look. Black tea protects antioxidants. Black tea protects with antioxidants. Shiitake mushroom boosts glow, and chia seed restores. Rest Restore, restores moisture. Um, let's see, this is $35. All right, Yensa is well known. I have one of their um, um, moisture creams for the face. So yeah, interesting. I will have to try this when I don't already have something on my face. Oh, and it tells you the meaning of yin on the inside of the box. The meaning of yin. Chinese. It's a Chinese word. Color of face. Um, so yin. English. Deep desire and passion. Vietnamese. Calm and peaceful. Oh, so wait a minute. There are several meanings in different countries that use the word yin. So in Chinese, yin, Y-E-N, means color and face. Um, in English, yin means deep desire and passion. And in Vietnamese, yin means calm and peaceful. And in Japanese, a yin is the currency. So Y-E-N is used differently with different meanings but spelled the same in these countries Japan, Vietnam, America and China. Interesting because you have yin in yinse, yinsa but this one says color and face. I hear something. Hmm. Okay. The next thing I'm going to pull out is a palette. And I actually think I might have this palette. I don't know where it is. Did I give it away yet? It's the Ace Beauty Violet Sage Palette. Jeez, maybe I'll just keep this one. This is it. I could have sworn I had this. So I think it's a beautiful palette. I think the color uh, theme is, is very pretty. Let me see if I can find the other one because I would hate to dig into this one and I can give this one away. So I'm going to go check my inventory and see if I can find it. What do you know? I found it. It has dust and everything. Let's see if I've used it. It looks like I've swatched it. So let's use this palette. Let's use this palette. I'm going to start off with uh, the palette. I'm going to I'm not going to bother swatching any of these uh, because I've done this before. Um, yeah. And it's the exact same one. Let me make sure. It is. It's the exact same palette, guys. So I'm going to give this one away. I'm going to give the one that I got today away. Um, yeah, that's what I'll do. I don't think my sister wants it. No. 
because I've given her a lot of palettes. All right, so let's put that one back in its That will be for a giveaway day. That's what I will do. So let's get started on this palette. I don't know what look to use, but I'll use something. Be right back. This is the Velvet Lip Liner. And as I was saying, but nobody was listening because I was not recording, this is blending in with my lip color. This color right here blends in with my lip color. So I can use it, but it's nothing but a nude for me. Let me go ahead and color in my mouth with it. Might as well. See that? Um, being careful not to break the, the pencil. That is basically a nude on me. And this is the, the definition of nude. It doesn't even look like it's there. So, that is that. I will put some blush on. Um, let me know what you guys think about this unboxing side by side. I'm going to unbox the Allure Beauty Box probably after this video to make it a separate video. I don't want to um, have this last, this video last that long. Plus, I have to go pick up my daughter anyways. So let me go ahead and get some blush. Be right back. All right.
right, guys, this is the, let me get back a little bit. This is the finished look. Um, I liked both boxes. I will not be um, unboxing the Allure Beauty box. I just don't want to make this video that long. Uh, but yeah, I did use some blush. It was liquid, liquid, bro. I can't talk. It was liquid blush in the color melon and it's blush bomb from flower beauty that is the blush that i do have on my face uh, but other than that guys let me know what your thoughts are on both of these boxes i do like both of them the same i don't i'm not a fan of getting products that i already have been sent um especially if it's the same box sending it again it's almost like they're wanting to get rid of uh, inventory or something. I don't know what they're doing there. But anyway, that is it. I like both boxes. I love the skincare that was in both boxes. I will be using most, if not all, of the skincare. One thing that I didn't do, I didn't respray my face. I said I was going to do that. Let's go ahead and use this Afterglow as a setting spray. Now, we used it as a priming spray for my face. Now, let's use it. For some reason, it's, it comes out when I shake it. Something's loose. Uh, but let's go ahead and... Yeah, it smells so good. It's, <coughs> it's a very refreshing smell. I like it. Uh, let's take a look. dry it out a little bit what do you guys think about the makeup I've used so far now I did use the Laura Geller New York powder foundation um, I would describe this as, as a um, light foundation they say color correcting and I do like it um, but yeah that's the foundation I have on my face and then you saw that I used the violet color, very, very light purple color, um, not heavy at all, not dark at all. It's not a deep purple because I am just going to get my daughter. It is a matte. I did put a light pink shimmer over it. I'm not sure if you guys see that. Uh, let me see if I can zoom in. I'm not sure if you guys see that light shimmer that I put on there, but yeah, I put it just a little bit. Um, but yeah, guys, that's that's basically it. I, I think I did a good job in using as much of the products in each of the boxes as I could, at least a variety of products. So yeah, let me know what your thoughts are. I will be doing the Stitch Fix uh, when I get home from getting my daughter, I will be doing the Stitch Fix try on uh, and I will put the BoxyCharm Ipsy Movie movie video up first and then will come the Stitch Fix. But guys, let me know your thoughts and we will see you in the next one.